Christine, and today the Bay Area may see some poor air quality, smoke or hazy skies. Yeah, and we've talked about this in the past, but that's been because smoke was coming down from Tahoe and the Caldor right. fire. And so it else. sort of made sense at least. Yes. But this time around, it's smoke from Southern California. The winds, boy, they'll take the smoke really? far and away. Fire, I really. mean, these are fires that we're not even really talking about here yeah. locally because they're not local. Uh, yet this is something that we're following. Let's go live to Crown Force Camila Barco to see how the conditions are now in Alameda County. Hi, Camila. Hi, Dario. Hi, James. So, yeah, we can see some of the effects of the smoke from those wildfires raging south of us here in the Bay Area. If you look over in the far end, you can see a slight haze over by the hills and people in other parts of the Bay Area may notice something similar. So, for example, the air quality is moderate in the coast, the central and here in the East Bay, as well as the Santa Clara Valley. And that means the air quality is mostly risky for people who are sensitive to air pollution. Those areas might see some smoke pol polluted looking skies because of the smoke from the fires across Southern California. However, places like the South Central and North Bay are experiencing good air quality. The smoke is expected to stay high aloft, so that means the air quality isn't expected to be unhealthy at ground level. But if you do smell smoke, there are a few things that you can do. Officials suggest that people stay indoors with their windows closed, and you can also Recirculate your AC and car vent systems to avoid that outside air from coming inside. Now, Dario James, I've been monitoring the air quality index here in Pleasanton, and it's been fluctuating over the past few hours. In, just in the last hour, it was at 51, and now it's at 57. So it's just going back and forth. But for reference, I want to say that the air quality index here in Pleasanton is moderate, but it has to be at 50 below 50 for it to be good air quality. So we may notice that air quality get better throughout the day. Daria James, back to you. Okay. Okay. That'll be some good news when that happens. Thank you very much, Camila. Let's see what we notice and what we.